Here's Bowel Mover from Cellcore, and this is a great product for constipation, but it also can get rid of parasites, and I have personal experience with this. I was on Para 3, which is the sledgehammer of killing all the parasites, and I did it every day for two months, and I don't recommend that. You're supposed to cycle it three weeks on, one week off. I did not do that, but after two months, I decided I should take a break from this because it's like having Mike Tyson in your gut punching you from the inside out, so I stopped Para 3. And after one week, I was supposed to get back on it, but I couldn't get myself to do it. So I stayed on Bowel Mover, and I got one parasite out per week for the next two months after that. So this alone can clear out parasites. So it's got your what you would expect to be in it for constipation with Cascara and Senna. It also has aloe, which can be healing for the gut. And then it's got wormwood and uh, clove, garlic. These are things that kill parasites. Now, this was actually designed by Dr. Todd Watts for his sister, who had about one bowel movement per month. And she had to take a lot of these. I forgot the dosage. More than 10. It could have been 20. I forgot the dosage. But it worked. And Todd says the point of this is to get that peristalsis back into your intestines like this, that motion that the muscles go through to evacuate. So we're reinstating peristalsis. So there's a lot of products that we carry for constipation, but none of them have ever said that, that we're trying to reinstate peristalsis. I've heard of stool softeners, I've heard of liver flushing, um, intestinal sweeping, but to reinstate peristalsis, that's unique of all the constipation products that we carry. So this is extremely important for step three, drainage. There's a lot of organs in the drainage category in step three, the lymphatic system, the colon, the liver, kidneys, the lungs, the sinuses, all those have to be working well before we go into getting rid of parasites in step four and five.